Secular Sakai saying, political violence grows in the U.S. Have any Canadians, you know, voiced concerns about a large influx of Americans seeking to stay in the country? There was a Safwark episode on this building a wall yeah. between Canada and the United States. Yeah. <laughs> so. yeah, yeah, yeah. And I, I, um, I have both a handful of friends in Canada, as well as uh, some family myself, um, as well as I have had some friends over the past couple of years that have lived their whole lives in the United States in various places and have um, moved. Um, I haven't heard any from the Canadian side of people like having, you know, big fears of a large influx of Americans. I can definitely tell you that over the last handful of years, there has been not only an uptick in searches uh, in America for like, how do you migrate to Canada? Um, but there also has been a, a slight increase, I think, in the amount of people that have gone. That's one of the things about US, Mexico and Canada is that we actually like trade citizens all the time. Like right. a bunch of people from Mexico come to the United States and a bunch of people from the United States go to Mexico every year. It's just it's this rotating door thing. You know, I, I, I don't I don't think we're going to have a large amount of Americans that just like go to Canada. It's very cold up there, you guys like. The Floridians. Not really. <laughs> it's a lot you, colder than Florida. That's all. I mean, uh, Vancouver. You at summer, that's you actually weather. have to turn on the air conditioner. That's good. I don't yeah, know about the rest. Yeah, yeah. But okay, I don't know about average people, but the government would love American a huge influx of Americans come to to United States. I mean, and justifiably so. It would be better. Like I know like a jokes aside and like oh my god americans are coming and ruining canada that would be a great thing for canada okay and I'm, what i say might be controversial to say okay right now it, canada is looking for a lot of immigration they're like really trying to bring immigrants okay in okay uh, from many places you know um but it's true that americans would be the highest how do i say this without sounding racist Mm. highest highest uh, uh population cap per year they, they would have no, they would have like would the most them. Amount. yeah i want i was gonna say highest quality but then i, realized I was gonna say value efficient. but i thought that yeah probably both yeah. of those words <laughs> they're the most productive okay and this is not about anything inherent about americans it's about mm -hmm. the amount of money spent on americans to get them to where they are productive every american on average is more productive than one canadian okay um and probably more productive than any person anywhere in the world okay and this is not just about the technology that america it has it's also about the human capital the investment in the human capital that america has made over more effectively than many, for some reason than many other countries in the world right yeah. so given that canada is accepting immigrants from so many places like I don't know, the middle east the philippines just because they want to increase those numbers they really need to increase their population right um americans just willingly come in that would be like they would be shown the red carpet like they would be like yeah come in like canada is actually the re one reason why canada is bringing in so much america uh so much immigration from around the world is because they're losing canadians to, to america okay america pays more per hour than canada so much of canada's top talent moves to america so That's people right. coming back from america to canada that would be really good for canada's economy Okay. Usually, guys, immigration people, it, a lot of people complain about, oh my God, people coming in. But usually, the countries that are experiencing people coming into their country, that's a good thing for them. Yeah. That's like a immigration coming in. You're you're benefiting from it. Yeah. It's it's very rare where that's when that's a negative. Um, that would be a negative outcome. It's generally a positive sign that more people want to your, want to come to your country than leave every year. Not saying it's a one-to-one -one correlation, but if you go look at the amount of countries in the world where they're having mass migrations out of them, you can you you can see why. So, I mean, yeah. Yeah. It's a, it's a, it's but it's just it's it's not just a good sign. It also will result in a better economy. Absolutely. Absolutely. Yeah. Yeah. 
um, yeah, immigration, more immigration is usually good. That's why mm -hmm. I'm so pro immigration, mm -hmm. right? Yeah. Get my best selling book, Why There Is No God, for free. Click on the link for it in the description.